usifiwe yesu nataiwa kwa hivyo kuna wanyama wale wazuri na wanyama wabaya kumbe na msi na atil sio ni kitu lakini kwa sababu kila mmoja wa wasilaji wakati wa busa wakenda ibadabia na msi ni bidanzi na wanyama wenye kuleni ameye na mwana mmoja mzee mbole lakini wewe na hii msikule lakini mzee mbao mwikaje na nipi nimesema na hicho ngwa sio mnyama kila nyamu ako na tabia fulani eh mwikalo wake ambayo inaandamana na yeye wala wasianiana yake na ndio mimi ninakataana na hicho nyangulea na ninaambia na ngutabia mataifa ya nje sana 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 wazungu wala mwanaso na wale unasikia ujumbe na alafu kuotumani kwa usiriani wazungu ndio ile ya songo mwaambie mwatabie the days Medanya to address ya kwa address the Africans Africa as mangas samalai those days are over mabai babinda si madalu yes allah amen i am saying this ni asiati every animal has a certain characteristics kila na moja tabia yake that that is born with it kila isia wanayo praise the lord amen and the video white guys wherever you are listening to me let you be ayo pala mo bedu kese moy it has taken long equity bi dai asa when you are like any the african brothers as mangas from today i say because of what god is going to do and what is happening now you white men you will come from god in our Africa kwaondoa ondola ga yuko dikwa den wa africa england weo we diko ka kumanda den de africa And that is why I am a fearfully black Africa. No joke to me then a mundo mwio utena wia wa Africa. Amesema kweli. Nitamtiwa kiboko. Niletewa kiboko tafadhali nyaunyo. Ndiye tewa mwanzi. Unajua nyaunyo ni kiboko <laughs> Niliwaambia na kuanga na mashindano nimekisha kiboko anataka kiboko kiboko ni nina tafsiri ndio wasikia wale Bwana asifiwe Yes una taiwa I'm saying this Ni asio Today is when the white guys Mabinda ala e milenela and wayo When you see a black man Wona mo mo bibida la mano mo na mundu mwio You like us with the mangage. Mtu bwana ni jana malai. I want to tell you something. Ndio mtaja kingo. The times and the seasons have changed. Mabinda na majira ni mabindo ku. I am a true man of God. I am an African. Ni mtu wa bwa ngai na ni ni mu Africa. Born in Kenya. Zai wa Kenya. Praise the Lord. Yesu na taiwe. With a with an African DNA. Na ni na DNA ya wa Africa. And I want you to think about this. During corona time. corona. The white guys, the wazungu, they were foreseen it that Africans will die like donkeys. Donkeys. They were predicting and saying this sickness madana makasi wa wo this pandemic kana ondo mudoku will kill so many africa we dikwa wa africa inge and then you know what was brought in our in, in africa first as as a misada you know what was brought first ni ile mifuko ya kuweka maiti the plastic bags ya kuweka lakini walileta ni wao waliingia huko maiti ya mifukozu ile ni mama alikilo mifukoni There is no place but even people died and the mark queer like Italy takula Italy Spain Spain where pop lives pala pop we call us if he was a holy father and i have some with, with the ability with the supernatural holiness why now turn in the wind the death dominate in his region jurisdiction neke neke kikucha mai mai pa From there kuma bau we went to the USA to the kuya USA the americans died um, like America. no one's business ma kwabio as if it was not enough na pate anete kukaingia ingine ilikuwa inaitwa ni zendeka ama ni astra zendeka zendeka 
kutoka wapi kuma India kuma India kiwanda kubwa ya kutengeneza mandawa duniani inakuanga India lakini aswazini nzeleka ama nzendeka ilifahamia waini wakakuma wakaanguka kuliko vile mesoka wanaanguka saa hii kwa ngombe aidi mafahamiwa kiwanda nene cha ndawa sumapo makwa makwa hiyo what was god trying to tell this This white skin who have been in the mentality the black skin God was telling them I am the god of the black Atabasi andwa yo aimea ninga i wandwa la yo So white man who and well follow your pride and melai yo melai mega the lilo the new For a long time, it has been said that we have developed the countries and are developing now the third world countries. Kanaben and the same day here na isuta kuna mataifa ile ya kwanza kuna ndile shambe ya pili ya kele na ya mwisho na ile si abandi na ya afrika wako ya mwisho na ma afrika ni bandi ambia mwenzako the overtaking speed tabia munani huko ya speed ya kupetuka nimesema hakuna watu walikufa kama wazungu na sema yangu mas pia tazungu mpaka awange zikwa gina wewe ndio na maidhikeka wanaenda kuwekwa kwa mbaya mpaka kuitwa kangani wanakatiwa mitaro hivi baitemi wa mitao hakuna nchi ya afrika watu walikufa kakatiwa mitaro patende ya afrika ndo mas pia matemi wa mitao maana mungu anapenda wa afrika pia nono ga hii ona ingine wende hapo god loves the and you see there is something unique in our continent peke ndo katika continent jito Nataka one one of the uniqueness of Africa. Nenda one kindu ke katika ne Africa. When God wanted to show his power. Ila ndai wenda kuona nyabina wake. He raised. Okay lile. Fera. Hello. Okay lile, okay lile balao. He raised Fera. Okay lile balao. Because civilization began in Africa. Nuru civilization ambe katika Africa. Began in Africa mako. In Africa mako. The first strongest man in the world, Mor- Superman, came from Africa. He was called Nimrod. Mondo ngoma wa mbe katika Africa aitwa Nimrod. Alizaliwa hapa Ethiopia. Asedwa Ethiopia. Na ndio walienda pale Dubai. Na hapo mwanje kuya Dubai. Wakaanza kutengeneza pale Iraq, wakaanza kutengeneza ule mnara wa Babel. Maji kusobya ule mnara wa Babel. So the ever mightiest man who ever lived who started technology innovation and all this was called nimrod according to history katukua is not the white man so african forever you are listening to me can you go back to opposition and mama ni kama mbe kita mwe sio kaile ile ni wenu when god wanted to anchor you with mankind ila ngai waenda kuzima na bila na mungu he chose egypt and we are egypt and he is the King of Egypt. Now how can you assume man this? Because first civilization, not civilization yambe, was in Egypt. Like in Egypt. Amen. 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 Ndiye ameficha mambo yake. Wa Afrika pale mko nisikieni vizuri leo. Ana ba Afrika bala muembe dikete ni asomo. Mashallah. Yes una taiwa. He raised Pharaoh. Oh kile bala. And the God took the children of Israel. Na kiyo tajele tete lai. And then he brings them to Africa. Na matu Africa. Mashallah. Amen. One of the you some of the unique things in Africa. Maundu amwe katika ala unique katika Africa. Mashallah. Yes una taiwa. Moses. Moses. Everybody who who Whoever stands whether Muslim whether an idol you mention Moses under the children of Israel people will know who Moses was where wa weta Moses kwa kwa Islam kana Hindi mama na Moses no wana sifiwa amen praise Allah amen where was Moses born Moses say weba in Africa that is the Africa where did he go where did Moses go to his way Moses umite mukaba in Africa the Africa Sali o Moses obia na naona haimutulukana I think to me naonanga Moses alioa pale tukana 
The longest river in the world. It is which river? Where is the origin of River Nile? Oh, uh, River Nile. Can I you me Victoria. So Africans, you are, you are supposed to be victorious in every way of life. Yes. Stop yes. behaving like that. Yes. Africans, stop behaving like you are short here. Yeah. You are not short as you are here. There is a lot in New Africa. It is time to, to discover, Amen. to recover, and to go, and to possess. Amen. Amen. I am saying this. Yes, sir. It is time Africans discover the lost integrity, the lost potential to, to, to discover the lost identity and then you rise up and go back to your position. Amen. Amen. Every raw material that is built in the world today comes from Africa. Africa. Tell me. Zabie, ni wapi umewahi kusikia Amerika na Europe, Britain, ati kuna dhahabu inachimbangwa huko? Amerika na Europe na kukungi wewe huyu dhahabu umetoka. Dhahabu ile inatumika Amerika na mataifa yote inatoka Afrika. Dhahabu leo kumika Amerika na ndio sio ndio umete Afrika. Africa is a great nation. Africa ni nene. And the God had a plan with Africa. Na ngai haina mpango na ndio Afrika. I know you are like confused. But I'm coming. Praise the Lord. Yes, you not Yes, you not Yes, Yes, Wakati Herode alikuwa anataka kuua mtoto. Herode wenda kuua kana. Mariamu na Yosefu wanaambiwa na malaika. Maria Maria na Yosefu Maria wao ni malaika. Ma Biblia nasema na malaika wa Bwana akamtokelezea Yosefu kwa ndoto. Biblia inasema malaika wa Ngai amemla Yosefu ndoto. Akamwambia, "Amwia, inuka, ukila, chukua yule mtoto, asola mwana." Yesu sasa Yesu yu. na mama yake na wake na uende na uigi ukanjivicha Afrika okay with Africa hey! 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 Mungu alikuja kuvicha yani Mungu baba onga ya saa akakuja kuvicha Mungu mwana Afrika akakuvicha ndai mwana ku Afrika is it is sweet kai kai moyo sema mimi acha acha simo kila mtu sema mystery kila mtu sema mystery Mungu baba gayasa anachukua Mungu mwana oh, sangai mwana akiona kimeumana ole kaingana maana Herode ameinuka Mungu alote wakila anajua kwamba Mungu mwana ai maana kana gayasa mwana hajafika kiwango cha kujitetea tabikete eh, miaka ya kuitetea kwa hivyo kuna wakati Mungu alikuwa mdogo hodheri na gayasa munini kumbuka Mungu anarembesha mambo kwa wakati wake kana gayasa hey. anakaweka maundu ndani yake Mungu sio chanzo cha kuchanganyikiwa lakini ameliwa kubulanelo alijua Yesu ako na kipindi cha kukua amani ya Yesu na kipindi cha kuya. Bwana asifiwe. Amen. Ninakuja tu. Ninokita tu. Na Mungu Baba, na Ngai Yesu, akamchukua Mungu Mwana. Asa Ngai Mwana. Na akamrisha Joseph. Na muamrisha Joseph. Akamwambia, "Amwia, enda ukaficha mtoto Misri. Enda ukabidekana kwa Misri." Sema Afrika. Asia Afrika. Mungu akakuja kuvicha, kuvicha. Mungu Baba akakuja kuvicha Mungu Mwana. Afrika gaya sawa kwa bila ngai mwana katika ndi Afrika hauwezi kuenda kuficha kitu cha maana mahali ambapo kuna athari mimi yeah. bila kitu cha maana bado yeah. bena muisho pressure lord amen kwa hivyo kwa bwana asifiwe yes unata iwe mungu alijua gaini wa amani afrika afrika kuna amani pemo huo na ndiye alituma na hicho atumie joseph joseph kwa kuja kuvicha mungu mwana gaini mwana hapa pa 
Wakati nilipofika vile naye alikia Yesu akatoka na Mungu akamwambia Joseph gaye Joseph chukua roho mtoto osha mwana yu na mama yake na wake maana wale lundu haya walikuwa natafuta mama nda kumua kumua mtoto kumua mwana wamekufa na kwa ambia mwenzako hata saa hii ya mwanae wana wale wamekuwa wanataka Afrika isambaratike wamekufa na watakufa na wale wanaishi tutawaua alama ni na Afrika iko na kwa una alama tia kwenda tuyo madika wale wamekuwa wanataka ndoto ya Afrika ishi nuke na ingie mahali pake na wanazuia hiyo ndoto we will put them down now ala bana ndani ya afrika iku eh nitu nitu mezi ande i am saying this i will try as much as possible ni data na bina pio this communication to reach our our brothers overseas kana otomani ubi kiando eh mabura na mtu kwa mchanza god came along gayokie When Jesus was seated in me in Egypt, ila Yesu abidi na misili. Time came, ebida yoka. And the God told Joseph, na ngai eya Joseph, the father of Jesus. Ile wa Yesu. During that time, ebida ni leo. Who was taking care of him? Wala wa musobia. It will be too shallow. Ni ila leo za ndamba ndamba la leo. It will be too shallow. Ni ila leo ndamba la leo. For you to start commenting. Kwa kukwambia ku comment. Whether Muslim, whether a Hindu, whether a Christian, whether a pagan, say, so Jesus said, "I have the Father." Where we call ya? Can I hear so in a hither wa kundi? I am saying, the way things work. Ne asia ondo mando mai le. God told Joseph, "Gai e Joseph." Now rise up. Where you killer? Go back, Shoka. Because those who were seeking to kill the boy yes, child, yes. the young day. No, the mama manda aku wakamwa na Jesus na aku. God told me it is time for Africa to arise and shine. Gaya me ya leader ya Africa kokela na kutiso. And that is why there is a lot of confusion right now for example in our country Kenya. Na nitoki tumebana kuvula 